Ramadan is the month of the Quranic quotient. This absolute and infallible work of God is the basis for the spiritual success of mankind. This mortal world is just amusement and play in the Quranic sense of the word. The real life is that of the hereafter, where immortality will be the norm. But surprisingly, even as Quran emphasizes on the triviality of this world, it has laid out a number of verses regarding the distribution of wealth, which apparently has no spiritual significance. However, Quran has a different point to make. There are at least six places regarding the inheritance laws mentioned in Quran. However, there is a noteworthy and perhaps a newsworthy point that we need to remember. Majority of these verses are mentioned in the chapter called An-Nisa, meaning the women. Yes, the word of God, Holy Quran, meant for the entire humanity of all times, is mentioning all the relationship which we think are very tribal. The father, mother, sister, grandfather, uncle, aunt, all these relationships are mentioned in detail regarding the inheritance laws of a deceased person, which only goes to show that life in this world may seem tribal, relationships may look silly, but everything has a significance, everything has a purpose.